Welcome to a Monday stream today with your trusty Spicetronaut. Hopefully your Twitch streamer of choice for today, or at least for this moment. At 12.33 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Oh, man. It's good to be back. So good to be back. I was on hiatus for about a week because my kids school just started up again two weeks ago since that time we have had two no three cases in the district so far so two cases at my kids at my elementary my kids elementary school in one case at my daughter's middle school. And boy, it's been rough. And then, of course, last week, beginning of last week, my two youngest were not feeling well and stayed home from school. We, of course, my wife and I got them uh, COVID tests which they weren't able to get until the next day. So we had to schedule it ahead of time and then they weren't able to, um, we weren't able to get them in until uh, 20, or uh, what am I saying? Until um, uh, until the next day you know so that was tuesday and then man it was just so like I see you gather before me. Hungry, terrified, crazy clutching your babes to your you know so anyway Emperor are you guys hearing that marched his legions into our lands laid siege to every fortress from here to the there i'll just mute that for now <laughs> What am I? All right, so there we go. Make sure all my levels are good. Make sure we're all good here. All right, here we go. Witcher three. All right, we're back. All right, let's see, where are we? Let's continue. This long search for Siri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse. Oh man, that's sad. Finding a young woman. Uma, the ugliest man alive, huh? The curse of Uma. Sorry, I noticed my mic. My mic was a little bit hot the last couple times. So I'm trying to balance it out just a little bit more and hopefully it won't be as hot this time. It was just peaking a little bit, which I know can be kind of annoying. So hopefully we're in a better position today. All right, looks like we're off to a good start here. First they killed my son, now they'll throw us out into the street. Throw us out into the street. Smell that hangs in the air. Do you know it? Carnal sins. All right. Hold on, let me check something out here. I want to make sure. I am graphics preset. What did I put it on originally? I think I have it on high, right? Yeah, 
Yeah, should be okay then. Rescale HUD. It's just looking a little bit. Looks okay. Hmm. On my monitor, it's looking a little bit wonky. All right, so we are on this quest here, Carnal Sins. Telling this story. Oh, God, that's right, because Priscilla was attacked. Oh, man, now I'm starting to remember. That sucked. That's right. Oh, so mad about that. We, we got to kill this guy. Whoever hurt Priscilla, man, that's just wrong. So wrong. I really need to change my armor up. Let me change my armor up. Let's do, uh, let's do, uh, this one doesn't look that great either though, does it? <gasps> Wait a minute. Oh, did I, maybe I moved it away. I thought for a second, what, what happened to my armor, guys? What happened to my armor? <clears throat> All right. It's got such good resistances, though. It just looks wonky as hell. <laughs> like, Geralt just doesn't look cool right now. So... bludgeoning damage wait what the hell what happened there why do i have this oh no did something happen why would i have this blunt sword what the hell is this all right ash rune and the Dithwen, which I think is, oh, it does the same amount of damage, okay, as the one that I currently have. Why, when did I get this blunt sword? God, I don't remember. It's been so long since I played this game, okay. Um, Enhanced griffin armor. Honestly, I wish I want to get this griffin armor, but the only thing is Oh, and this is specifically Witcher gear too. See, this is nice. But look, how do I get the regular griffin armor? Hmm. I don't know. As you can tell, I'm not very happy with my outfit right now. Not happy at all. But that's okay. All right, well, let's just continue on here. So, Carnal Sins, investigate the alley where Priscilla was attacked using your Witcher senses. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta totally find this dude and rip his throat out. Whoever's doing this, cause, oh, you go after Priscilla, man, you're asking for, for trouble. I feel like these guys are behind it. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. You got something to say for yourself? Huh? Huh? Oi, mate, watch it. Huh? What was that now? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh, that's disgusting. There is a Ryzen's. Whistling Wendy. Uh, she actually has like a name and everything. Whistling Wendy. Wait a minute, what is happening here? Grab him! 
Oh shit. Hello. Uh what's happening? Oh, I can't. Why can't I Shut up and fight. What the hell is happening now? Why am I fighting these guys? Dude, get. You're a son of a whore. Can I parry a punch? Oh, yeah, I can. Fucking two against one. Fuck you, man. This lady. All right, let me get out. Let me get out. No, no, no. This is not fair right now. I'm stuck in the corner. I'm stuck in the corner. Fuck you. All right, here we go. Jesus Christ. All right, come on. Bring it. Gotta drink a lot of water here. <laughs> All right, come on. Come on. Son of a whore. Let's end this. Douche. Jesus. I think you got me too, huh? More trouble yeah, than it was worth. Holes can fight back. Uh. Calm down, I'm not gonna hurt you. What are you doing here? Getting vengeance. Well, why are you staring? Have you not heard killers always return to the scene of their crime? Me and my brothers are waiting to give like... him a warm welcome. For Priscilla. Almost did her in the whole sun. I know. Here to look for clues and find anyone who might Yeah, I'm gonna kill the bastard. That's what I'm gonna do. But I can tell you what I know. You and Priscilla friends? Friends? Nah. But she saw more than a stupid whore in me. Treated me with respect. It mattered. I was yeah, to up Priscilla's away. pretty awesome. Think of a decent trade, but none would take me. Not as a washerwoman, nor a servant, nor a cook. Felt like a leper, I did. But Priscilla, she was different. She was Agreed different. Agreed to put me in a play, you see. Lots of the other actors, they were afraid on account of her jesting about the eternal fire. Whistling Wendy on stage, can you imagine it? Well, dream's gone now. I'm back to work in street corners. Sorry to hear that. Street corners. Work goes. Also, I tell myself. Hold on a second. Give me one second, guys. I want to. I want to do something real quick. <clears throat> I would like to do something really quick. That I've been wanting to do. And I just ran out of time. Um, and maybe I can't do it on here. No, no, no. Oh, you know what? Oh, God. It's going to... Yeah. I figured I got no viewers right now, though, so hold on. Bear with me here. Bear with me here. Um, I 
<clears throat> this is something I meant to This is something I meant to um, set up before Oops. Seriously, you can't do single digits, huh? Um, okay, I guess I'll do that. Huh? Yes. So where do we want this? Where do we want to put this? What seems like an okay place to put it right here? Seem like an okay place. Top right. I don't know. All right, let's keep it at top right for now then and see what happens. All right, we back. Priscilla wasn't the sole victim. You aware of that? Oh, dearie. Of course I was. This didn't start yesterday. Others have died like this before. Beggars, street girls, orphans. But who'd have a drama concern about them? Human rubbish. It's what the guards call us. Recall any names? They didn't have proper ones. Baldy, curly buns. That's what folk called them. No friends, no families. Their bodies were burned long ago. Oh, that sucks. Take care now. I gotta look around some more. Appreciate it if you didn't disturb me. Naturally. Yep. We'll stand aside, be here. I didn't even get a chance but to look around. Tell us if you find anything else. I was just interested in her name, and then all of a sudden she's like walking past me, and those dudes start attacking me. Damn. Actually, now I'm looking at Oh, right, because the mini map is up here, huh? The mini map. Okay. One second. One second. Uh. Where are we at? So we got the goal up here. We probably want to move it down here, maybe. Maybe make it a little smaller. I don't know, actually. Actually, that's, that's an okay size. It's an okay size. How about that? Let me see if this will work. How's this? I mean, it's kind of covering up the controls, but that's not I probably going to be Probably going to be the least obtrusive. Hold on. Actually, let me move it more. Sorry. <laughs> let me move it further down more just so it's not like... That's probably good. That's good. There we go. Yeah. That way it's just it's just blocking. Yeah, that's fine. That's cool. Perfect. Cool. Whoops. Uh, let me just meditate and get my. The hell time is it right now? I can't do that right now? Okay, whatever. Whatevs. Ooh, what's this? Okay. 
Concerned citizen sermon. Concerned citizen sermon. All right, let's see. Remember, good people, the light cast by the fire dispels every darkness, reveals each lie, exposes every unworthy and debauched soul. Not even shape-shifting dopplers can hide from its light. Not even witches and sorceresses so adept at fooling the common folk. Not the loose women who walk the street and fog men's minds with their charms. Abandon then the treacherous and immoral magic arcane. Cover your bodies in modesty and provoke no unclean thoughts. And the eternal fire, oh shit, those guys, fuck these guys. And the eternal fire, sorry about that, will expose for you all monsters and sinners, or else burn you too in its flames, concerned citizen. <sighs> Had that script. Oh, right, this is that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Concerned citizen, my ass. All right. A brazier, this time of year. What do you mean? What time of year is it? Wait, aren't braziers used as sources of light as well? Or is it just heat? Excuse me? The hell is an optimometer? Always got to get that water. All right. So more investigations. Ah, here we go. That's not your stomping ground. Who the hell are you talking about? A brazier. This time of year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already saw that. There we go. I know that smell. Formaldehyde. Formaldehyde. Man's footprint. The murderer's maybe. Weighed on his heel. Took a step back, human. Priscilla's. Human. Oh, human blood? Shit. Okay. Murderer fled before the guards arrived. Ran this way. And then he posted that unsavory letter. Trail ends here. Strange. Even I couldn't jump this wall. Uh magic user, maybe? Teleported out. <laughs> Geralt, he's like, even I couldn't jump this wall. So, what is it? Think I know what happened here. Priscilla fought back, her assailant retreated, and knocked over the brazier. Someone must have heard it. Maybe saw something, started hollering. Guards showed up. Murderer didn't finish the job, didn't cover his tracks. Just collected himself and leapt over the wall. Trail ends there. You divined all this from a pile of rubbish and a few prints in the mud? Do that practically every day in my profession. And practice makes perfect. True enough. Just like I can tell <laughs> right off if a pent will pay or try to wriggle out of it. That particular skill I could use myself. <laughs> I was going to say, man. All right, cool. Take care now. And I got a murderer to catch. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, excuse me, whistling Wendy. Why do they call you that anyway? Actually, I don't want to know. Best keep that a secret. All right, what's next? Examine the place where the woodcarver died using her witcher's senses. All right, the woodcarver. Man, these shady individuals. Are we ever going to find out who the hell these dudes are? Hey. Oh man, that's it. That's it. 
what? Huh? Huh? You had an issue? I mean, the guard's right there, so I'm not going to clock you right now, but hey. Come on. I want to know what you guys are doing here. Why are you a shady individual? Why are you a shady individual, man? Can I just punch him? Like once? <laughs> Please. Oh, that's a cool fountain. Hey, this bird is not phased by me at all. Wow. Okay. Anyone home? Begun. Or I'll sick me hounds on you. Molly, Strige, Kim. Strige. Relax. I'm here about Fabian Meyer, looking for his killer. That's all to get it. Hell's yeah. Sit your stupid much lay down. Come on. Come on in. Slowly now, he lets bite you. <laughs> this guy. Slowly now, he lets they bite you. So are you. So who might you be? The Stiff's brother. Gus is the name. <laughs> the <laughs> Stiff's together, brother. Meyer and Meyer. Oh, right. The woodcarver was also a dwarf, now? wasn't he? Just Meyer. Name it. <laughs> Just Meyer. As soon as I find Aww. a man for this shack, I'll head on to Mahakam. Near my family, Man, he got some big ass dogs. So, what do you want to know? He's gonna burn it. What the hell's he doing? About Fabian. Tell me what you know about the murder in order, in detail. Hmm? It was like this. In detail. I had some work in Oxenfurt, and I was coming home. I saw a plume of smoke rising over the city. I thought to myself, blast it, gonna miss him burn another hag. But the smoke wasn't coming from Hyrax Square. It was coming from here. See the soot stains? <laughs> That's where they burned our sculptures. What? The folk gathered around the blaze and found Fabian here beside it. They'd already loaded him on the cart by the time I arrived. Talk to your neighbors. Did they see anything suspicious beforehand? Hear anything? Claimed not to. But even if they had, they'd not have helped. You know they had folk give bleak orphans in the street a white berth so as not to stain their poor lanes. They kill them some dwarf. Hmm. Your brother have any enemies? Anyone dislike him? Threaten him, maybe? Nah. It was Fabian who threatened this one lass. Oh, you were a good dwarf, a craftsman like no other. But you were an incorrigible whoremonger as well. Whenever we put a bit of coin aside, I'd say, let's buy some tools, quality timber. No, he grabbed the purse and head out whoring. Damn. Took the following one in particular. He'd say, it is all your fault, dirty bitch, human dish rag. Whoa. Oh, obscenities. Don't rightly know what that was about. Maybe he was in love with her. Um. No I can find in this dish rag. Hmm? City cemetery. She died a few days back, oh. quietly in her sleep. Her pawn said a fever took her. Hmm, this is all very suspicious. Fine, we've talked enough. Need to look around. Be my guest. Just beware of the dogs. Beware of the dogs? How about you just keep your dogs off me? Huh? Huh? I gotta watch out for your damn dogs. Look at this dog, man. I... That is a... Beast. The hell is this? Like a Doberman, you know, mixed with a bear? I'm gonna loot your stuff, buddy. Statues of the old gods. Nothing but women. Shapely ones. <laughs> Geralt. God damn it, Geralt. You're always. What's this about? Murderer dragged something heavy. Dragged something across the floor. Statues. More dragged it from one wall to the other. Whoa! What's happening? Blood stains. That's where Fabian lay when they found him. It's this concerned citizen sermon. Another one. 
All right, let's see. Remember, good people, that fire can be both a blessing and a curse. Fire can warm with its flames. Fire can prepare our nourishment. Fire can drive off the horrors of the dark. Fire can also scorch, burn, and incinerate. That is why we must live in harmony with eternal fire and its commandments. Fuck them. Whoever fails to heed its lessons, whoever lives in ignorance of it, whoever mocks it. <clears throat> Whoops. The same shall lose his life in its flames. Take my counsel to heart, good people, or you will reap the consequences of your deeds. Concerned citizen. Why do I feel like the concerned citizen is a douchebag? You ain't no concerned citizen. Alright. Hey, doggy. Can I just look at that box back there? Please don't bite my paws off. <laughs> don't mind me. It's all good. Just looting your owner. Alright, let's see. What else? What else? Alright, let's go in here then, I guess. Mind if I go inside the workshop? I've not even peeked inside since since they found Fabian. But I'll open it for you if you want. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Is there going to be a bunch of crazy shit in here? Quest updated. <clears throat> oh shit, why did I roll in? You always got to tuck and roll when you enter a building, right, Geralt? Powdered pearl. All right, I'll take it. Nope, that's not exactly what I want to do. There we go. Let's keep these fires burning. Hmm. Furniture got knocked over. This looks like it was kicked. More formaldehyde? Formaldehyde. Doubt Fabian used it. More blood stains, but not near enough to say he bled to death. Unless somebody got rid of the blood, left a few stains behind. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Ah, looks like there's one more thing here. Eyes. Holy shit, that's disgusting. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you, Gus Meyer, for your time. The investigation continues. Goodbye, dog. And goodbye, other dog. And now we will continue to find Eustace, the corpse collector. Watch it be used as the corpse collector, right? Oi, Witcher! Coroner wants to see you. Been another victim. Tell me to what? say the main door will be open for you. You're to come as soon as you can. Damn. I'm thinking that not apparent to you. Shady individual. Oh, there's a lot of dead people here. What the hell? I think you meant victims. Look at this. This looks pretty messed up. You used us, the corpse collector. <laughs> the corpse collector. <laughs> Just Ford cash, keeping it cash, you know? You bring Fabian Meyer's body to the morgue. Fabian. Oh, Fabian. Yeah, no ice, no art. One of them, right? Uh. Neighbors, I recall. Right. Yes. <laughs> you search Fabian's body? Well, I uh, cast an eye in his pockets, <laughs> made sure nothing went to waste. I call a spade a spade. 
You rob corpses. Ooh. I don't want to call a prick a prick. It's none of your fucking concern. Mm. What, are you a tax collector? Peace off. Mule. Yeah, I'm a tax collector. Bitch. Tell me. Talk. What did you find on him? I, uh, I had you wish. Yeah, that's right. Triflings, baubles, glow-speeded wing, handful of coins, and a letter. Look, vellum, quality parchment, that. Ooh, <laughs> vellum. The right inner cell is new. That's human skin. Yeah. Priscilla, next victim's name. If you'd given this to the right person, she might not have been hurt. Yeah, you what fuck. Do I, do I care what happens to some Priscilla. Oh my in this god. <sighs> I really want to hit him. Get out of my side. I'm going to hit him. <laughs> yes. Boy, what kind of shoes was he wearing? What was that for? <laughs> for everything. For wearing diapers in plain daylight, man. <laughs> He's just like, everything. Yeah, and stay down. All right, talk to the coroner. Sick. Sick of it all. Oh, you're going to get back up, huh? <laughs> I wonder if I should clock him again. All right. Hey, we got somebody just tuned in. Hello and welcome. Welcome, Master Witcher. Ah, yes, thank you. See, this guy knows. Even though he's got a funny looking helmet. All right, let's see. Where is the corridor? Man, the security around here is lax. Geralt, right? I'm glad you're here. That's right. Held off on the autopsy till you arrived. Nice oh, really? You, especially oh. given you didn't seem pleased about my previous visit. Because you came unannounced and in unfortunate company. I also had Reverend Nathaniel to contend with. Our spiritual caretaker has left the city on some important matter. And I know who you are, what drives you. I'm more than happy to aid your investigation. All right, let's go. Let's start. Gladly. The wounds conform to the killer's modus operandi. The victim was bound and forced to drink formaldehyde. Next, the killer removed the eyes, placed burning coals in the sockets, then opened the rib cage and... What's this? A parchment made of human skin. A message from the murderer. Made of human of skin. Victim. How do they know it's human skin that fast? Like, is it that obvious? Do you know her? Yes. Even went to her estate once with. <sighs> Gotta find her. Uh oh. <laughs> Patricia Vagel, bud. Wait, I don't remember who that is. Found. Oh, letter found on Joris Aquinas's body. Oh, okay. Concerned citizen. Yeah, sure. Hmm. So the letter was tucked in there? That's fucked up. That's pretty messed up, guys. Okay. Um. Hold on a second. Do, 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 do. Hold on. I gotta remember who the hell Patricia... Bagel butt is. Oh. Nope. Philippa Eilhart. Oh, that's the. She's like a mage, right? Priscilla is the one that got hurt. Where the hell? Have I not met her yet? I thought I met her. Hmm. Wait, let me go back down. Bagel bud, right? What? What? Okay. I could have sworn I met her. Maybe not. Okay. Go to the Bagel Bud's residence. All right, here we go. We're going questing. Oh, yeah, buddy. You're, you're such a good guy, man. You, you got a good heart. You know that? Yeah. No. Oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, good stuff. Okay. Where the hell am I going? 
So we need to get all the way out here. Isn't the vagal buds? That's where the horse racing was, right? Pretty sure. Where the hell am I right now? All right, so let's go over to this. Oh, oops. Let's go over here and get over to the Vagal Bud residence. Oh God, the Reapers come for me. Fast travel. Fast travel's so good in this game. So good. All right, here we go. Wait, is this it? Vagal Blood, Vagal Bud Residence. I think, yeah, this is the place where I did the horse racing. What does this person have against these people? So he's, he's, he kills, he tries to kill Priscilla. He's killed a woodcarver, a dwarf woodcarver. He's killed, um, who was that guy in there? I don't remember. The guy that we just saw? I don't know. <laughs> and now he's trying to kill a vagal bud, huh? What's the deal? Oh, wait, why can't I go in? Uh, hello? Oh, do I need to talk to these guys? Let me in. What do you want? Patricia. To Patricia Vagelbud. You think any bum off the street can? Her hey. life's in danger. Let me in, or have her blood on your hands. I'm not a bum. If you thought this I'm a witcher, out, and I'll let you in. I'll throw my ass out the door. I always thought a guard was supposed to protect his charge, not his ass. Yeah. So be it. I'll take you to Lady Vagelbud. Just no trickery. Understand. Um, I'm a witcher, so trickery ain't in the game. Oh, what a pleasant surprise! <sighs> Hi. I gotta see your mother. Her life's in danger. In danger? Come now. I saw mother this morning. She seems sad, true, but in perfect health. Uh, she seems kind of suspicious. I'm hunting a serial killer, and I've got reason to believe your mother will be his next victim. Why, even if it's true, our guards? He's exceptionally cruel when he kills, tortures his victims, cuts out their hearts. So let's see how she is. Messed up shit. Case. I find this all very hard to believe, but you appear to be quite serious. Oh, Please, I'm serious. Follow me. Okay, maybe not. Maybe she's not suspicious. I don't know. A fire fit for Bellatane, except it's the wrong time of year. I mentioned mother seems sad. Do you remember? Wait a in minute. Fact, she's in the midst of a crisis of faith. A rather serious one. We'd been to Novigrad. Mother had seen the pyres in High Rock Square, uttered not a word on our way home. She had all the holy books in signals reliquaries gathered, taken outside and burnt. Then she locked herself in her room. We need to hurry. Uh, that sounds crazy. Yeah, there's something going on. There is something going on, and you didn't think to call me. God damn it, Ingrid. Hear that? Calm, quiet. Uh huh. It seems to be in order. Or she she's in, dead. Just to be sure. You're relentless, aren't you? Fine. Yep. But wait here, please. Mother's certainly not in the mood for guests. What the? She did it. You know what? <laughs> oh shit. He, he ran out the other door. Catch oh. Him. God. The fridge. All right, go, go, go. Run, Gerald. Run. Oh my God. Oh shit. No, get away from me. I don't have time to fight dogs. Spread out. Murder is still here. Shit, he's killing guys left and right. I'm not the one you guys want to kill. Where'd the guy go? Oh man, did we miss? We we 
We, you guys completely missed the dude that ran out here. You idiots! Wait a minute. Go this way. I don't want to fight you guys. You guys completely fucked up and let the guy run past you. Wait, is this the guy? No. Nah. Did he look like a guard? I'm trying to figure out. Like, I think he looked like a guard, though, didn't he? So maybe I do have to kill these guys. Hmm. All right, well, I guess I'll fight these guys. quick. He's trying to parry that guy. Parry! There we go. Goodbye. Halt! Or I'll put a bolt between your eyes! Listen, you got the wrong guy. Save your trickery! Yep. Taking you to the heiress! <sighs> Well, killer's already escaped. Lead the way, hero. <laughs> God damn it. You know what? Uh, I wish it would let me just run after the guy. Wasn't easy, but lower that crossbow before you hurt yourself. This man is innocent. Forgive me. I saw him running. Thought it was the killer fleeing. I was chasing him, and I'd have caught him if you hadn't gotten in my way. Yeah. Out of my sight at once. Mother, why did he do this to her? Why? Mm, mm hmm. Because she blasphemed the eternal fire, only thing that ties her to the other victims. That's what's going on. Although, did Ingrid, I know this Priscilla is a hard time for you, but do that? I don't know. Usually, the killer leaves a note on the body, a note indicating his next victim. May I? Very well. Mm, but you should be on your don't own. Think I do that's... not wish to see her in this state. I do not wish to remember her like that. Yeah, that's probably and a good idea. Let her be the last victim. Please. I mean, I was trying. I was trying. Yeesh. Bruises, broken fingernails. She defended herself. Must be why it took him longer, and why he almost got caught. Here it is. Sweet Nettie, crippled Kate's. Growing bolder, not just the name, but the place too. Won't get away this time. Hmm. Same wounds as the previous victims. Examination would be a waste of time. Gotta get to crippled Kate's fast. All right, let's see. Remember, good people, that the fire devours everything in its path, sparing no one and stopping for nothing. The fire burns all sinners alike, be they paupers or princes, men or non-humans. Weak or powerful, whoever breaks its commandments, whoever does not heed the church's counsel, whoever worships false gods, the same shall be turned to ash in its flame. Live then in the truth of the eternal flame. Fuck you guys. Listen to its holy men, for they are your shepherd. Concerned citizen. Concerned citizen. Fucking douchebag. 
Okay. Well, that certainly was pleasant. I don't know why I'm going looting around this lady. Sorry, I shouldn't be looting. I am so sorry. That is the most fucked up thing I've ever seen. All right, I'm gonna kill this guy. Don't you worry. I will kill this guy. All right, let's go. And now it's raining. What was with the fire, though? Does that have anything to do with anything? Like, why burn all this stuff? Is that what was going on? It was that guy, right? He was trying to burn everything. And the eternal fire and all that crap. Okay. Too late again. Hopefully we can stop whatever's going to happen this next time. Alright, so we need to get to Sweet Nettie at Crippled Kate's. So where the hell is that? Oh, okay. It's back in Novigrad. Uh, actually, let's go here. That seems like the most direct path, because we could just go up that way. Hmm... Let it rhyme. Yikes. Uh oh, what's happening? This the place. Greetings, Witcher. It's nearby. Ready? Wait, what the hell? Hold on. What the hell are you talking about? What is this? Wait a minute. <laughs> Very well. Hurry, please. Uh what is this in regards to? <laughs> that was weird. Yeah, no. Let's let's just continue with this. I have no idea what that was. Whoops, sorry. Sorry, lady. Everyone's like running around trying to get the hell out of the rain, I guess. Alright. Okay. What is it in here? Okay. Sweet Nettie, where is she? Upstairs. But she's with a oh. family Do not disturb them. Are you kidding me? Like this guy works that fast? Like what kind of shit? Can you take a break from your goddamn killing? Jesus. No, wait, what the? Upstairs. Upstairs, Geralt. There we go. There's the stairs. Alright, 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 alright. Where's the... Come on. Where's the rooms? Guys, you guys are all... routing me here. Shit. Uh, okay. One more flight. I don't have time. I don't have time. This lady needs my help. Oh shit! No one will hear you, bitch. Not a soul. You though. What the? Hear you in a minute. Yet again, you disturbed me. Oh my and I god! Seem being disturbed. I was to play with sweet Nettie, render her not so sweet, but I shall see to you first. Try it, you bastard. Hey. <laughs> oh, 
What do I want? Burn this fucker? Come on. Come on. Bitch. Poker. Yeah, I'll take your bread too. Fucker. All right, can I untie her? You're free now. Oh, jeez. Messed up, dude. Oh, thank you. Thank you. If not for you. He asked if I did everything, and I said, for the right price, of course. And then he smiled. Oh, God, it gave me the shivers. And then he hit me. So hard I passed out. I was bound when I came to. And he was here in the poker, in the fire. <laughs> Calm down. He won't hurt you anymore. He won't hurt anyone. I still fucked up, though. Hmm. Okay, well that was, um... Harrowing. Alright, let's go. Talk to Dandelion. Hi, um, do you guys know what the hell just happened upstairs? Oh. We can go at it here, or at my place. Okay, I gotta get out of here. Let's go talk to Dandelion. Yikes. No loitering round here. My, what a freak. I get time for this. I don't have time for this man's reason. What a freak. You're the freak. Okay. Oh, sorry, buddy. Didn't see you there. I got another haircut. Haircut time. Extreme makeover. Geralt edition. All right, here we go. All right. Tell Dandelion I got the bastard. How's better, right? Oh, good. Y yes. <sighs> yes, she can talk. Great. Did you take care of what I asked? Yeah. The witch's way. <laughs> Thank you, Geralt. For me and Priscilla. Did my part. Your turn now. Take care of her. Good care. I will. You'll see. Treat her better than the dryads of Broccolon could. She's talking again. Better. A surprise. Isn't it? Professor Von Gratz told me her wounds are healing faster than a troll's. Not the most flattering comparison, <laughs> but encouraging. The trolls. Maybe she might even sing again someday. For now, we'll try performing as a duo. She'll play the lute, I'll sing. 
Dandelion and Calamera. Got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Sounds great. Good luck, Dandelion. On stage and off. Well, job well done, huh? Yeah, I thought this was going to be a, <laughs> a lot less, you know, disturbing quest, but it actually turned out to be very over the top brutal so that was very interesting okay uh what do we got ugly baby <laughs> no nah, hold on let's do some more of these um side quests wait where the hell are we we are still in novigrad right yeah so let's do some of these Wait, can I talk to Triss? She's gone, isn't she? What happens if I do this quest, actually? Hold on. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't even show up. She took a boat to wherever the hell she was going. Damn, does that mean I, like, failed it or missed out on the quest somehow? Okay, how about this one? A deadly plot. Meet Dijkstra at the Passiflora. Upon finding Dijkstra mingling among the fugitive mages, then watching him assist them in their flight, Geralt got the sinking feeling the erstwhile spy would want a favor in return. He could not have been more correct, for as soon as the mages had set sail for Kovir's hospitable shores... That's right, she went to... Yeah, that's right, she took the mages. That's where Triss went. Now I remember. Dijkstra confessed that he had set in motion a plot to assassinate Radovid and asked the Witcher to meet him promptly at the Passiflora. <sighs> right, we're going to go kill the king. Uh, sure. <laughs> Let's make that my next quest. It's time to off the king, baby. Of course, this is probably not going to go the way I imagine it. Okay. Actually, do we need to see a blacksmith? What are my weapons at? 89, 91. Eh, I guess we're okay. I did get some new pants. Trackers, trousers. Resistance to piercing damage, bludgeoning, slashing, and damage from monsters. <gasps> I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, so if you hit right trigger, player stats, DPS, silver sword. I lack me the silver sword, that's for sure. All right, cool. What I was trying to do was this. Okay, assassin's trousers. So yeah, my stuff is currently better. Okay. I'm always on the lookout for a new <laughs> set of armor because look at this thing. What am I wearing? I don't really look like a badass witcher. I look more like a... I don't know, a roly-poly. A green rolled up uh, winter something. I don't know, can't talk. Words fail me at the moment, guys, sorry. Um, I have this blunt sword. I don't remember how the hell I got that. I guess I could sell some stuff, but I'm not really... Not really hurting for cash at the moment. So. 
Let's just go, I guess. Let's go meet Dijkstra. Deekstra. Where the hell are you, buddy? <laughs> Eternal fire. Psh. Wait, is he up here? Yeah, he's up here, I think. Hey! Ah. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright. Okay, sorry. You, okay, you leave first. Or not, okay? Wait, hey! What the? Am I not supposed to come in here? Okay, goodbye. Yeah. Go. You. Okay. What's going on with these people? Do, 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 do. All right, let's go down here. People are everywhere. Bumping into me. Trying to knock me out of the doorway. That is not cool. Oh, scribe. Okay. No, I don't really want to talk to you right now. Alright. Where the hell is Dreekstra? What exactly is happening? Okay. Alright, here we go. White Wolf. Welcome to the Passive Flora. Oh, no sign of recognition in your eyes. Mm. Greetings. Uh... Don't fret. I'm sure I look quite different from when we last saw each other. Uh, which was? Oh, eons ago. You and Master Dandelion appeared, two halflings in tow. What a smash they were, the little chaps. We recount that night to this day. Yeah, sorry, but I'm here to... Speak <laughs> softly. I know very well why you're here. <laughs> Geralt. This way, please. He's not. He's not. Uh, he's not this clued way. in yet. Sorry. Do 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 do. Which your girl? Hi. Boss has been waiting. I bet he has. Let's go kill us a king. Oh. Geralt, you're here. Good. Good. Oh, oh God. A face only a mother could love, huh? It's on everyone's mind. Many would like to do it, so there's nothing to fear. Besides, this venue's got a tradition in this domain. Might even consider it fabled. Falka planned her revolt here. By extension, King Vrydank's murder, too. Comparing yourself to Falka? As far as I can recall, no one in Redania's annals has a bloodier reputation. Her rebellion changed the course of history. That's what we have in common. In terms of blood, we aim only to shed Radovids. I'm pleased you're willing to play a part. Must admit, I wasn't certain you'd show. see need to know what you expect of me first i believe you know my associate roach you here retired intelligence <laughs> operatives roach we have a club defended the king once Crush air. to assassinate another now mm -hmm. i'm proud of it yet i considered all the options and found none better Radovid's proven many times he only ever forwards his own interests. When Kedwin asked for help, he invaded. 
When I begged him to support Vizima's defense, he showed me the door. The war nears its end. We've come to a decisive phase. We must act quickly. I've no illusions. Only a dead Radovid means a free Temeria. All right. What do you want from me? One of our co-conspirators ventured out to meet an informer. He's not returned, yet the plan's success hinges on what he's learned. We've got to find him. And you're the best tracker around. Tracker, huh? Really? <laughs> Anything else you can tell me? Where this associate was last seen, for instance? He's traveling as a journeyman, itinerant cobbler. That's his cover. He was first to venture across the Pontar. Most probably did so via the Redanian checkpoint. We've a man there who should know more. Calls himself Gregor. Gregor. Yeah, let's do uh, it. I'll talk to Gregor. I'll talk, Thank man. You. I'm still in it for the for the Try talking. Not, to too much attention. <laughs> Remember, not sure if I'll kill the guy the yet, but I'll I'll be here. Suspicion. The future of Tamaria. The future of the future North. of the North. No. <laughs> to fuck it up. See ya. We're counting on you, Geralt. Are you? Anyone see you come in? No Maybe not put all your eggs in one basket, but uh Up the street, I mean. No one. No one's getting the better of you. I'm not nervous. Vernon and Roche. I don't mind snooping around this guy's place and stealing his shit. <laughs> what about the streets for a time? Rich guy. Rich guy over here. See, the issue with doing this, like, okay, great, yeah, the king is terrible. He's a douchebag, right? But then, who's gonna replace him, you know? What, what, what are the, what's the alternative? And that's the part that concerns me. Yeah, I'll take that dumpling. Dumplings are good. God, this guy has a really lofty place. Yeah, I'll take that water too. Water, really? That's all that's there? Okay. And a smoking pipe. There we go. Got some more dumplings. Man, I really want dumplings now. It's making me hungry. A casket. Oh, yeah, I can sell this stuff, though, right? Yeah, might as well take it. What are you tripping over, Geralt? He's, like, tripping over pillows and shit. Learn to walk. All right. Who's slamming doors? All right, what's over here? Apple. Some people are just like slamming shit downstairs. Okay. Hold on, I want that chest. How do I get to that? Jump. Okay, nope. Don't jump like that. Jump like this! Get. <laughs> What's in the ch- Oh, Jesus. Okay. What if I did this? No? Ah! Ah! It, ah. Oh! Almost. Almost. Nope. Maybe it's just not gonna let me do that. Come on! Really? Hmm. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, water. No, nope. let me loot the. Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> really? That's it? What? I thought this. Okay. I thought this was going to be something. Well. I'll just cut that part out of the video. Mm. Don't need to see me being a bumbling idiot, do we? <laughs> or 
for Geralt. Ooh, honeycomb. Yeah, I'll take some of that. Ah, here's a chest. Cow's milk. What the fuck? Who keeps that in a chest? Is it even good anymore? Plus, I don't drink cow's milk. I don't know why I took that. Oat milk for the win, baby. All right, come on. Oh, what's over here? What's over here? Ah, wolf hide? Sure, I'll take it. Butter knife? No thanks. Deer hide? Yep. And Stamelford's dust? Sure. I got some selling to do. All right. I forgot what the hell I was doing. Ah, here we go. Talk to the Redanian liaison. Okay, cool. <laughs> Got it. I'm just looting this guy's place right now, though, so. Having fun looting. Ah, now she is a Not much loot, though. Not much loot. Okay, any books of interest? Not really. Got some bread. Got some hardened leather. Anything else? Nope. That's it. All right. Goodbye. I bid you all adieu. All right. What do I want to do? So talk to the Redanian liaison. Looks like he's pretty far. Is he on the other side of town? Because there's a fast travel sign over here. And I love fast traveling. So let's do that. Fast travel time. All right. Oh, God. Why is the liaison all the way out in the middle of nowhere? <laughs> Shit. Okay. Um. Well, maybe at least I can fast travel here. Let's fast travel to the glory gate and then run the fuck all the way over here, I guess. Sure. Christ. Uh oh, what just happened? Everything's still good? But there was like a glitch. Uh all right, so I still got a ways to go, huh? Alright, Roach. Did Roach just come out of the water? God damn it, Roach. What are you doing? How did you even get over there? What the... Mm. What the fuck? Okay. Wow. That was quite an entrance. Shit. <laughs> That's... Uh... <laughs> that is one way to get your horse, I guess, huh? All right, let's go. City of Novigrad. Fucking sucks. All right, let's go. But let's go talk to this Redanian liaison. Man, my horse has quite a bit of stamina now, huh? I got the new saddle bags, I got the new saddle, I got the new um what do you call it? The headpiece thingy. Yeah, that is what you call it. The headpiece thingy. See? Slow now. Wanna see the headpiece thingy? There it is. Nice. Nice, right? Holy shit! I thought my dog was doing that for a second. <laughs> or not my dog, my horse. <laughs> my dog. Yep. I I clearly uh I clearly know what's going on around here. Alright, buddy. Are you yep, you're Gregor, huh? Alright, let's talk. Looking for Gregor. Gregor. Who are you? Geralt of Rivia. Dijkstra sent me. Dijkstra. John Dijkstra. 
been expecting someone. Let's take a walk. What the fuck happened there? Did he all of a sudden not have his helmet? Nice job decorating your guard post. My orders of our gracious and merciful ruler, the good king. What is happening? When they go to the wide shot, it's like he doesn't have a helmet, and then all of a sudden he's got a helmet on again. It's like you get far enough away and the helmet disappears. Does not have enough power to render. Just humans at each other's throats. That's not Radovid's fault. Hmm. Who do you think hmm. set down the laws that mean folk hung for such offenses? The fucking king. All right. <laughs> down to business. Talk. Must know why I'm here. Yeah, he came through here on his way out. Didn't come back, though. Patrol went out yesterday, reported an abandoned car to ways off the road. Aimed to go out there, see if it's his. Couldn't get away. Thanks. Good enough to start with. Farewell. Hold on. You got a pass? Won't get back through without one. Yeah, I got one. Oh, I got right. a pass. Thanks. See ya. See you laters. Um, find the shoemaker's wagon, huh? Hey, you mind if I take this boat? Hold on, where the hell's the shoemaker's wagon? Is it along the coast? Because that would be cool. Nope. <laughs> of course it's inland. Of course. Where the fuck is Roach? Roach is way the fuck over there. Jesus Christ. All right, <laughs> let me just take the boat over there, why not? Let's just take the boat across the river. Uh, let me ride the boat. Let me ride the boat. There we go. Take the helm. And off we go. So easy. So easy. To, to drive a boat. You have no idea, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Look how easy this is. So easy. It's all you do. Is all, you, all you do is just point. <laughs> and run into some shit. <laughs> Your boat is damaged. Critical amounts of damage will cause it to sink. No! That's fine. We're just trying to get over here. <laughs> Okay, almost there. Almost there. Don't worry. This is fine. This is fine. And boom. Here we go. Uh, can I not leave? Okay, good. <laughs> hey, buddy. You want a boat? It's a little damaged, but uh, yep. Yeah, just fish. Yep, there you go. Looks like you got a real big fish there, buddy. Good job. Alright, what the hell am I looking at? Oh yeah, let's go to this notice board. Anything good here? Anything good? Blah, blah, blah. No, not really. Alright, fine. Fine. Alright, where the hell is my horse now? Roach is going to erupt out of this guy's spleen. Watch. Come on. Boom! No, nope. there he is. <laughs> there he is. Hello, Roach. Hello, how are you? Come on. Shoot. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We are all not away. Oh shit, here we go. Find the shoemaker's wagon. Doesn't look damaged. Okay. To look around. Might Wait, find what? something. Oh shit, what's happening? Oh shit, hello. Hello. Hey! Fucking wolves, get out of here. Oh, that's a warg. The fuck is a warg? Oh, that one's a wolf, okay. The other one was a warg. What the hell's a warg? 
Is that like a wolf mixed with a bear? Uh, I don't know. Ah, here's the wagon. I see it now. First I was like, huh? What wagon? There's the wagon. All right. And of course we're going to loot all this. Because, you know, I am a poor witcher. Well, that was shit. So did he get killed by uh, Wonder where it's where some is. wolves? Oh, there's the other one. A shoe. Something tells me I'm on the right trail. More shoes. <laughs> Wonder where it's where it is. And yet another one. Something tells me I'm on the right trail. All right, let's go down to whatever the hell this is. Looks like there's a cage or something over here. Oh, didn't I rescue a guy here? That's right, I remember. There was a dude I rescued over here once. Okay, so that's not it. Let's see, what else? What else? More you shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so shoes, shoes, and more shoes. I guess we just follow the trail of shoes. A storm, damn it. A shoe. Okay. Something tells me I'm on the right trail. <laughs> yep, I would say so. <laughs> Some shit up there. Bear? Bear? It's a bear, I swear to God. What the hell is it, actually? Sounds like something. Sounds like something unpleasant. Yeah, that looks big, whatever it is. Could be a bear. Can't quite make it out. Maybe it's just another wolf or something. Don't What's mind me. What's who doing here? Oh, it's the troll guy. Right. What the hell is his name again? Or is this a different guy? Could be a different guy. Rock troll bro. Brains. Away go with you go. Hmm? Judy pick me. I can see that. Just wondering how those shoes is wound up here. Here, Judy's grown. Like the mushroom. Hmm? Shoes don't sprout from the ground. You see who left them behind here? Speak no log. Oh, I'm gonna get Og and Pog. Og and Pog? Those your friends? Findering of great Og Pog. Human finder on big suited cart. Suited big like so. <laughs> what did they do to this human? Og Pog man's cover to take. They're over. Do you eat him? Cave. Nah, no. Body man's. Stringy man's. Blah. Huh? Oggy make man's. Suzy make. Frog. Pog and rog. Suzy make. <laughs> yeah, why do they need shoes? What? What is this? Do they need shoes? Suzy huh? on whom is it? Suzy wants og, pog, and rog. Big lords, trollers be like humans did. Hmm. Okay. So long. So they have ambitions. Okay, he wants to be a humans, huh? All right. Rock troll. That's interesting. Oh, that's cool. So does he just like sit there?
like as a rock. That would be crazy, right? If you came up on this thing in the woods or something, like it's just kind of like crouched. And then you're like, oh, that's a nice uh, pointy rock to sit on. And then all of a sudden you get on and it starts moving and gets up and you're like, holy shit, look at this thing. I mean, that would be crazy. Crazy. All right, so here we go. The cave. I don't know. I don't know about going in there. Let's see. Let's go up. Let's go up. Up and over, shall we? Let's go up and over so that we are not caught unawares. I bet it's right there. Wait. Yeah, that's probably it right there, actually. There's some scaffolding. <gasps> Ooh. A new sword, hell yeah. Hold on, let's see. What's the one I just picked up? That one? Yeah, so. Sadly, it's not as good as the one I have. It's okay. Um, actually, you know what? I do have some weapon repair kits. Let's just repair my steel sword. Why not? Does that get me up to 100%? Yeah, it does. All right, cool. Well, cool. I hope I don't have to fight trolls. Because that guy's pretty cool, and I don't really want to have to hurt his brothers or whatever. Okay. Mushrooms. Wait, what's this, uh... Why is there a question mark up there? Is it above me? Oh, okay. I found the entrance. What the hell is it doing? There we go. <laughs> it just wasn't updating. Like, what is happening? Uh oh. They're in there. They're in there. Hello, guys. Don't mind me. Just looking for a dude. Oh. Oh, he's in there. Is he okay? He looks like he's alive, right? So hopefully he's okay. Let's just keep this civil, shall we? No need to fight. Okay, so he's teaching them stuff, <laughs> apparently. Alright, here we go. Let's see what this is. Taller? <laughs> Should have known. Who better to teach trolls how to cuss? <laughs> Taking a leak over there. <laughs> the fuck is this guy? Relax, Og. This bugger's an old friend of mine. I'd make for a veiny morsel. Right, true that. Yeah. Just look at the plowing bastard. Not but skin and bones. <laughs> well, General Trolls, our time I traveled on. You uh practice what I taught you. Give you a fucking exam next time I come through. Don't let no go. Tell the shit. Sit us down. Tell her suck cock shoesies me. <laughs> wow. Let's see. I don't necessarily want to kill these guys. I can see you've made friends. But Tyler needs to come with me. Blood nowhere Tyler go. Tyler shoes makes. But I need him. Tyler's here stay. You shoes got. 
Agshusatna, Ragatna, Pagatna. Kala shoes is make, Kala go. Maybe just make some shoes and then we can go. <laughs> now let's all stay calm. Taller will be back. He just needs to come with me. We'll uh, get some leather for your shoes. Yeah, there you go. Mm -hmm. Listen to Garrow. He's telling the plowing truth. Hmm? <laughs> Look at your feet. They're fucking mammoth. Need a damn bale of leather to make shoes for him. Understand? <laughs> Me and Geralt will get some cocksucking leather. Then I'll come back and make your blasted shoes for you. Shoes is pog for? And rug for? Two pairs for each of you now pricks. Hmm. <laughs> ago, we're back come must. Knew you buggers were good mates. Sit tight, be back in a bit. Got to admit, you have a Yay, see, we didn't have to solve this with violence. <laughs> Witchers are sterile. Alrighty. Escort Taller. Hello, Taller. Where the fuck did you go? Let's go. I don't have time for this. Speed it up, my friend. Why is there still a question mark right there? Come. Where the hell are you going? Okay. Okay, where am I taking this guy again? Does not say. Are we gonna walk the whole way like this? I don't even know where we're going, dude. Maybe I'll get my horse. <laughs> oh god. Roach. God damn it. Where the hell are you? Oh, now he's over there. Come on. You can do it. Come phase through the rock again. Jesus. Jesus. Are you... Oh my god. He's down here, isn't he? Can you... Please? <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess my horse um, is currently incapacitated. So let's go. We'll run there. Can you run, dude, or what? Wow. Come on, there's some stuff up here that probably wants to kill us, and I gotta protect you, because that's what happens. Wait, do I have my crossbow? Yeah. What is he doing? What are you doing? Uh. Farewell. Yeah, I do. Most of the fucking time, thanks. <laughs> oh, there's some wolves, buddy. Better watch out. Oh, you're going back to your wagon. I get what you're doing. Jesus, why'd you go that way? That was like the long-ass way. Okay, now what? Thanks again, Geralt. I'll take it from here. And I'll be sure to tell Roach and Dijkstra how you buggered Og and his mates sideways. As I see it, they'll be so impressed they'll shit themselves. So what'll you do now? What do you mean? Head back to Novigrad. Dijkstra, Roach and I have got a master plan to set in motion. I'll ask again. Details. Forgive me, mate. I plow in calm. See, were it just up to me, I'd spill it loud and proud. You're trustworthy like no one else I know. But I'm not on my own, so 
Blooming unilateral decisions are out of the question. Trap stays shut, I'm afraid. Right, gotcha. <laughs> All right, well. So long, Taller, and good luck. Oh, I can bloody use it. Radovid's one crafty all with a clap. But we'll figure a way around that twat. Soon the old bloody North will be blathering about how he got <laughs> fucked. Careful, it's not also blathering about three assassins drawn and quartered. Hmm. <laughs> Fear not, Geralt. We know what we're doing. Farewell. Do you? That was it, huh? I was just supposed to get that guy. Okay. Well, what else? What else we got then? Find a book with a red cover. Um, sure. Let's do this one. What time is it? We are coming up on... Uh, I got about 20 more minutes. We're good. Coming up on two hours. That's when I'm going to... Shut off. My limit will be reached. Okay, let's see. So... Geralt stopped by a certain Novigrad book merchant whose owner recognized him at once. He said someone had left a book with him a long time ago with instructions to give it to Geralt if he ever got the chance. This naturally piqued the Witcher's curiosity. Sadly, the book dealer did not know the book's exact present location, only that it had a red cover and that Geralt should look for it in his stacks of dusty tomes and manuscripts. Okay... Where is this? Up here. And guess what? Oh, well, I guess I can go down to the hangman's tree. <laughs> and my goddamn horse. Look at this guy. All right. All right. Well, let's make our way to the hangman's tree and fast travel whoosh, all the way back up to Novigrad. Is he gonna spring out of the box? Seriously, where? Why does he? There he is. Jeez. Roach, man. Roach, you have got to be the single most annoying horse I have ever had in my video game life. Oh, shit. Oh, sorry, guys. Don't mind me. I am a terrible driver. Holy shit. Oh, ghouls? No, thanks. <laughs> no, thanks. I'm good. Uh, wait a minute. I'm trying to get to the goddamn hangman's tree. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm going completely the wrong way. There we go. And fast travel. Fast travel, fast travel, fast travel. Okay. Right to High Rock Square. All right. Don't mind if I do. Do, do, do. Let's see if I can find that book. Find the book. Uh. Shit. <laughs> Hold on a sec. Ooh, high stakes Gwent tournament. No. Look at this guy. The great transfiguration is happening. <laughs> He's phasing in and out of realities. Hey! You're going too fast. Slow down, buddy. You call this living, Witcher? 
<laughs> I call it vibing. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. There you go. Oh shit. <laughs> oh man. All right. All right. Where are we going? Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember this guy. All right. Cool. So let's find the book with the red cover, right? How the hell uh, are we going to do that? Do I need to go up the stairs or what? Oh, I can go up here. Cool. Cool. All right, here we go. Let's see. Oh, there's a book with a red cover. No, I can't pick it up. Ah, oh, there is a book with a red cover. The Treatment of Furuncles Through Cauterization. A study. The Treatment of Furuncles <laughs> Through Cauterization. A study. A study. Everyone's seen a boil, usually more than they'd care to. These deformities don't just mar your beauty. They can be signs of disease, or even the disease's cause and epicenter. If your lungs wheeze and your heart flutters, or if you're just sick of postules, you can carve them off. Be free of it. <laughs> free of this ill for good. When you go to carve off a boil, use a sharp knife, which you've had a dog lick thoroughly beforehand, or a dog's tongue works wonders in healing wounds. You gotta be brave as you go about it, slicing as confidently and steadily as if carving off a hunk of cheese. And quickly cauterize a resultant wound using a red-hot poker. Don't pay any mind to screams or tears. Pus, bile, and any other, any other humors need to be gathered in a basin, then dumped in a pit, and the pit covered, else the illness might return. <sighs> okay, that's, um, that's, uh, that's the heavy, re that's all the heavy reading I can do for today, guys. Is that not the book, then? Okay, let's see. Maybe this is the book, My Manifesto, The Life of Jacques de Aldersberg. My Manifesto. Must be it. There's a letter inside. The reasons for choosing Jacques de Aldersberg as Grand Master remain a mystery. The Order of the White Rose had gone through a crisis in those times and was, and was on the verge of collapse. So one might guess that the Brethren wished to have someone decisive as their leaders, someone with a clear vision. De Aldersberg was precisely such a man. One of his first decisions was to change the Brotherhood's name to the Order of the Flaming Rose. The most puzzling aspect, however, is that the Order and the King himself decided to trust a man who for all intents and purposes, had appeared out of nowhere. They say he was a wanderer, an itinerant priest, <laughs> itinerant priest, who moved crowds with his speeches, declaiming non-humans. They say he worked miracles and showed his flock visions of a world destroyed by the white frost. He was undoubtedly a man of great charisma, one instilled with unshakable principles which he in turn tried to instill in others. Was he, a truly, was he truly a source? Was he indeed gifted with raw magic talent? That we will never know for certain. Hmm. Oh, here's the letter. Letter from A. Witcher. Wow, this is to me directly, huh? In the ocean of possibilities, some events are more likely and less, and some less. It is not easy to fish out the first. Not even one's intellect stretches through all time and space. Wow, that's lofty. I left this letter for you in the hope that, despite all odds, you will come across it one day. For I must warn you, mankind is threatened. The prophesied destruction by the White Frost is not just the babbling of some mad she-elf. Perhaps I will have the opportunity con to convince you of this in person. If not, I must rely on this letter, which you will read many years from now, at a time when you know more than you did when we first met. Know that nothing will save the world except preparing its entire population for this catastrophe. The old tales say a child of the elder blood can stave off the danger, but I tried and failed. <laughs> Siri, right? Ever since I have been haunted by a hideous vision, a crowned wraith, the specter of my failure. I was the chosen one, and the chosen one failed. You and your brotherhood are our only hope. When the time of the wolf's blizzard comes, men shall perish, and only the ubermen will survive. The supermen. Your duty is to give the world ubermen. Whatever you think of me, do not fail, as I have failed. 
pay. Hmm. Okay. What the? More Abundia, the vampire's last likeness. Thereupon, Isabella took Edward's glistening visage in her hand and embraced his icy lips, which were twisted into a cynical grin. Forgive me, my love, she whispered, stifling the sobs, heaving her bosom. But my heart doth long with fiercer passion for, <laughs> passion for yon werewolf, whom thou hatest with all thy vampiric thouness. "'Tis for the best,' spoke Edward, shifting his pale face towards the equally pale moon. "'With me thy life was ever endangered. With yon werewolf thou shalt know peace and happiness. Oh my god!' Edward turned around and took a step towards the exit, but Isabella grabbed his wrist and bade he stop. The touch of her hand was so tender, his heart newly began to beat anew after centuries of deathly stillness. There is more, spoke she, averting his penetrating gaze. I am with child. Holy shit. God. That's like Twilight if it was written in the... Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. Hi, I wasn't reading that book. Nope, not me. Not would not be caught dead reading that fucking trash. Hold on, let me see. There's a book behind you that I need to get really quick. Don't mind me. Tyromancy or the noble art of cheese divination. Uh, sure. <laughs> what splendid diversity reigns in the kingdom of cheese? You know what? <laughs> I don't know. I don't have time for this right now. Okay, cool. Cheese. Great. Um, <laughs> Alright, so we found the book. What the hell? There's the letter. Do I need to talk to this guy? Ah, you're back. Yep. Oh, that's it. Uh, okay. Farewell. What the fuck? Why am I so much taller all of a sudden? Oh, I'm standing on his pile of books. Of course. That's what Geralt does. Alright. Alright, we don't want to do this quest yet. But I think, since I am so close to time... Um... Well, how about let's do... I guess it's, we can't finish off this Novigrad stuff just yet. Let's go over to Skellige. What about this one? The truth is in the stars. Deep in the swampy woods of Velen, there is a roadside altar praising the glories of one of the forgotten gods. That is where Geralt encountered a shriveled, half-senile old man who claimed he could foretell the future and would read Geralt's fortune for a small fee. Uh, no thanks. All right, I got any contracts i can do actually sylvester amello wait oh is this the guy <laughs> is this the dude that like just approached me when i was going through novigrad hold on seeing the merchant's guild is my best for my stories creature huh i don't know i don't know if that actually was the guy or not Oh, right. That's right. I got to go get my... I got to collect the reward from this. I actually did this a while ago, didn't I? Um... Hmm. I don't know. I don't necessarily want to go back to Valen. Maybe I'll stick around Novigrad for a little bit. Let's just do this contract, but we'll do this next time. Um... Yeah, so for now. All right, let's see where this is, actually. That must be what, what that was, right? Or maybe not. I don't know. It was weird, because the dude was, like, over here, wasn't he? Because I went to the docks, and then I started running up here, because I needed to get over here. And then this dude came out, and he was like, hey, let's do the thing. And I'm like, uh, no. <laughs> and then I just walked off, but now I don't remember quite what the hell that was for. Huh. 
Okay. Actually, hold on. Let me check out the armor. Before I go, before I call it a day, let's go talk to the armor really quick. Where the hell is the armor? Oh, yeah, he's back here. Sorry. Ah. What? He's closed or what? Come on, buddy. It's like seven o'clock. Oh, there we go. <laughs> there he is. Hello. Top notch swords. Show me what you have in stock. Let's see if there's anything. I know I can sell this stuff, so let me sell you this. Sell that. Sell that. Um. Anything I want to buy? I don't think so. I don't think so. Does he have any armor that's worth getting here? Let's see. I wish I really knew. <gasps> oh, that might be good. I kind of wish I knew, like, there was how it looked on me. Because, you know, I wish there was a way to preview it or something. Because I just... Like, okay, sometimes it looks fine here, but then once I put it on Geralt, it looks like shit. And I just am trying to avoid that. All right. Let's see if I can craft anything. Mountain folk boots. Hmm. Honestly, what I really want is this, the enhanced griffin armor. Because this is actually witcher gear. I just need to find regular griffin armor, apparently. All right, well, let's just uh, repair all our stuff. And... What else? Do we want to dismantle anything? I don't know. Not really. It's not really anything I want to buy. I kind of want to buy this right here because it looks like it might be cool. It definitely is a little bit better than what we have. I mean, eh, I mean, the resistances aren't as great. But it offers a little bit more protection, so. Anyway, ugh, sorry, I am out of time. So we will continue this next time. We'll continue this on Wednesday. So long. At my new time of 12.30 PST, that's Pacific Standard Time. So, cool. All right. Well, as usual, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for, for watching and supporting. And please toss a follow to your Witcher so that I can uh, feel validated in this time. No. Um, <laughs> I'm just doing this for fun, actually, and uh, I appreciate anybody who stops by and even looks uh, around and, and, and watches for a few minutes and maybe not like what they see and go somewhere else. That's cool. I'm cool with that. Um, I'm doing this so I can play The Witcher, and I just was like, hey, why not stream it? So here I am. Anyway, this has been fun. So this is part 21. I'm hoping to... Uh, get done with this game very soon so I can start to play other games or I might just go back and do all the side quests when I'm done with the main quest. I don't know yet. Um, but again, yes, thank you for, for watching. If you followed, thank you for that. Please follow me on Twitter as well at CrossBeyond. 
That's where I do all my updates on schedule and other things. Um, so it's good to get me there so you know what is happening. Uh, and also feel free to jump over to my website, crossbeyondproductions.com. That is my film and video production company where I do, you guessed it, film and video production. Short films, music videos, wedding videos, commercials, all kinds of things. And that is what I do when I'm not streaming or being a dad or a husband or a pet owner or a otherwise very busy individual. So yeah, until then, I will see you on Wednesday. This is your favorite Spice Tronaut signing out. Keep it spicy, guys.